Hi, this is Christopher Gofford, Los Angeles Times reporter and the creator of the podcasts Dirty John and Detective Trap. I'm excited to tell you about my new podcast, The Trials of Frank Carson. It's a story of power, politics, and the law in California's Central Valley. Frank Carson was a combative and controversial criminal defense attorney who spent his career accusing police and prosecutors of corruption. Then he was charged with murder. We'll tell you the story over eight episodes. Here's a quick preview. Follow us for new episodes over the next six weeks, available wherever you get your podcasts. A 64-year-old attorney is making his way slowly up the concrete steps of the courthouse in Modesto, California. His body is racked with pain. His heavy shoulders are hunched forward over the cane he carries in his right hand. From his left hand swings a cracked black leather satchel stuffed with his legal files. He's here at 8.30 on a Monday morning in June 2019 to do the unpopular work of defending the wrongly accused, the thoroughly guilty, and clients at every point in between. He's made this trip thousands of times. In better days, he swaggered the flamboyant terror of cops and prosecutors and judges. I haven't had any qualms about going after law enforcement for lying. If they fudge, once they fudge, it's open season. This is Frank Carson, the most combative and controversial criminal defense lawyer in Stanislaus County. His kidneys are failing, his sciatic nerve is aflame, and his morning Vicodin hasn't kicked in. The effort to get up the steps makes him wince, but he hates to give any satisfaction to his enemies. He has many. For decades, he's defeated his law enforcement adversaries in court and raged against them in unapologetically venomous terms. He names names in a Central Valley legal community where the cast of characters is small and the memories long. You know, they say, well, Mr. Carson, you're person. You know what? It can't be any more personal to the guy that I'm representing. And even if I had a doubt about my client's innocence by the time we started the trial, usually by the end of it, I was absolutely convinced. I've had attorneys, uh, God rest their soul, some are dead now, and they said, oh, Frank, you should have seen me. It was Carson-esque. I told him off and all that. That isn't the point. The point is to win. As he shuffles between courtrooms, cops watch him pass, and a chill seems to enter their mood. To the law enforcement establishment, the man with the cane and the black leather satchel is something more malevolent than a clever lawyer who pushes boundaries. This is why Carson will eventually make his way to the courtroom at the end of the first floor hall. There, one of the longest murder trials in California history is unfolding. There, for more than a year, Carson has taken his seat at the defense table, not as the attorney, but as the accused. To the district attorney, Carson's trial represents long overdue justice for a killer with a law license, a kind of local mob boss known as Uncle Frank. To Carson's supporters, it's the culmination of a massive law enforcement conspiracy bent on destroying him for doing his job too well. These are the competing versions of reality in the people of the state of California versus Frank Carson et al. when I arrive at the Modesto courthouse. Each scenario seems staggeringly weird and improbable, each too fantastic to be believed. But before I saw it, so would the spectacle of an attorney representing murder defendants in the courthouse where he was on trial as one himself. One of the first things Carson tells me is, I've given him hell for 25 years, putting my thumb in the eye of the man. And so he was not totally surprised when, one morning four years earlier, authorities had come for him. Frank Carson, this is the Manzica Police Department. Come to the front door, put your hands up, we have a search warrant. Frank Carson, we have a search warrant. Put your hands up. Contact, front door. Check outside, put your hands up, sir. From the Los Angeles Times, this is The Trials of Frank Carson. I'm Christopher Gofford. Episode 1, The Lawyer and the Thief. New episodes of The Trials of Frank Carson are available for each of the next six weeks. To find them, search for The Trials of Frank Carson wherever you get your LA Times podcasts. Thank you.